we got quite a bit of mail, actually. Start off with the... Uh, we'll just start from the top. 130,802 points. Alright, what's a good trick? What's a good trick, Happy Home Academy? Try displaying furniture that's all the same color. Cool, that's a terrible trick. Uh, Bank of Nook. 950 bells interest. Alright. Curly. To Mega Delts Eric. There's one thing I'd like to tell you today, okay? Muscles aren't built in a day. Intense daily training is everything. Don't be a slacker. Okay, that's it. Man, calling me out. Calling me out, Curly. Candy, I was shopping when I found Glitter Glue. I bought it so fast because Glitter Glue. <laughs> Have you ever impulse bought a thing then wished you hadn't? Because now there's Glitter Glue everywhere. <laughs> so true. All right, Lopez, what do you got to say? This one might be weird. Uh, Lopez had a strange dream about me last night. I was absolutely crushing some grilled cheese. Like you were tearing into it, just getting wild. <laughs> anyway, I woke up hungry and decided to write you. Tastily. Lopez. That is a very strange letter to send someone. Oh, wow. Oh, I want that tiny little house. I want that tiny little house so bad. Decided to begin selling toys. Limited time offer until December 25th. Yeah, I want this house. Oh, absolutely. Absolutely sold. Faux shearling coat. Gown coat. Oh, man. Oh, <laughs> this holiday sweat. Oh! Oh, I love it. Oh, I love this so much. Uh, layered socks. Yeah, we're going to need some layered socks for sure. It's getting chilly out, right? <laughs> Get some Ugg boots. <laughs> all right, so platypus and plumander. What, what, are, you, what are you all thinking um, as far as our outfit here? I'm thinking this, this festive sweater. One of these holiday sweaters. Either the red one or the green one. And maybe one of these knit hats. Or maybe one of these yodel sweaters. Just so both of you guys know, and, and Platypus, I think this is coming for you eventually too. Uh, I in Stardew Valley, I named one of my chicken one of my chickens uh, Plumander. And I named the second one. I just got a, a second one last night, but you nobody was there. But I named it after you, Slayer of Pizza, since you were around for my uh, my start Stardew Valley stream. Uh, I will say though, Slayer of Pizza, when I went to name my chicken Slayer of Pizza. Uh, it had not enough characters for the A on the end of the, the pizza. And so it just said Slayer of Piz. <laughs> so I, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so I, I went with, uh, Pizza Slayer instead <laughs> for the name of the chicken. Cause I did not want a chicken named Slayer of Piz. All right. I think we're going to go with this outfit. Yeah, I was immediately like, that is a very unfortunate cropping of that name. <laughs> I don't know if I can eat raw eggs in Animal Crossing. Uh, I don't know if that's an option. I feel like I feel like in Animal Crossing, eating raw eggs would be especially frowned upon. Uh, like, considering that all of the other characters are animals. Um, it seems like, seems like kind of a... Seems like kind of a fucked up thing to do. You can eat the Easter eggs. Oh yeah, that's right. Actually. I think I have some. Somewhere. Probably. Oh, maybe not. Actually, uh, yeah, no. Uh, same Plumander. Um, I'm pretty sure that after Easter was over, I was like... I need to get rid of these eggs. Uh, I, I'm, I'm going to go insane if I see another egg. So, uh, yeah. Um, what did I come in here to do? Oh, yeah. I wanted to try and customize the dollhouse. Yeah. No, after Easter was over, I don't, I don't know about you all, but I was like, I, I'd i be fine the rest of my life not seeing another one of these Easter eggs. Yeah, the eggs really... 
yeah, it, it was, uh, so the game came out and they condition you, they condition you to be super excited every time you see a balloon in the sky, right? That's how they condition you when you start playing this game. And then Easter rolls around and uh, you get so excited because there's so many balloons, uh, all these like really colorful balloons. They're just full of garbage. Absolutely full of garbage that you don't want. Oh, you ha you recently started over? Yeah. I considered that um, when I had put... I'd put about maybe 20 or 30 hours into the game, and then I was thinking, like, man, if I started this over, I could really do things right the second time around. But then, to your point, I was like, I don't know if I want to deal with this. Yeah, <laughs> not worth it. <laughs> Plus, you start off the game with, like, the really crappy tools. Like, I don't even think you can cut down a tree when you first start, right? Because you just have, like, that stone axe. Um, so what do we want to replace this with? Let me... Actually, before we get started on all this... Um, let's go back to the Able Sisters and see if we can find any, like cool festive designs maybe maybe like a like a like a festive brick this will go straight up christmas Let's see what we get okay holiday holiday is an option as well ooh these bricks are interesting I honestly don't even really know what I'm looking for. Although I wonder if this is going to look bad because of the other... Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. This kind of feels like a bit much. I don't know. It's hard to tell, too, because there's no snow on the ground. Maybe I will try Snowflake. Or I might just use my white bricks, honestly. Like, these are not bad. Then I have to replace everything. And that's just a lot of work. That's a lot of work I don't want to do. <laughs> why, would I, why would I be playing a game if I had to actually play it, you know? Nobody wants to do that. Yeah, playing games. Why would I why would I play this game? I'd much rather just download the game and then pay somebody else to design my whole island for me. That sounds that sounds good. You know, to be fair, that is kind of why you're here. <laughs> True. <laughs> oh. Now hang on a second. I think we could we might be able to tell if we like it, but it'll probably still look better once it actually snows, would be my guess. Hmm. Got it. It's a little too repetitive. And it looks like they didn't they didn't put a transparent square in the corner so it ends up being that like full square shape. Yeah. All right. I think we're just going to do it the old-fashioned way. I think we're just going to use uh one of my cream cream brick designs. Well, this this poses an interesting challenge. Hmm. Did I build, did I build this bridge after I put that in? All right, hang on a second. Let's not freak out. <laughs> maybe, maybe if we do this, maybe if we do that. Not gonna lie, I'm kind of freaking out, but you know, we'll see. All right, all right, it's all good. We're in the clear. 
All right. What do you think, Francine? You like the cream brick? Oh, I forgot that she calls me dimples now. Fine as a frog's hair. Do frogs have hair? I don't think they do. Kind of makes me question whether or not that was a compliment. <laughs> 